and I'm back with more Legend of Mana. Last time we saved a girl in a cavern. And we also picked some stuff out of a tree. While I'm at it, might as well pick some more stuff out of a tree, because you never know when you could de need more produce. Another cabadillo! Bonk. There we go. Here are some seeds I've produced. These are good seeds. Come back in a few days for the fruits. So yes, I've done three different voices for the fucking giant tree. Shows what I'm trying to do with this whole game. Then again, unless you're Tipo, I'm probably just gonna forget. Because Tipo is, I come, how you doing? You know, that sort of thing. It's like, that creaky, awful, cockney. Um, so, let's see. There's Flyerfy Lamp that would take me to another town, as would the, as would the flame. Let's see, medallion. Oh. Oh, it's this one. So, um... Remember what I said about random encounters and turning them off? This is one of those places where I'm just gonna turn them off. And you'll see why in a minute. Please listen up! Today is your lucky day. If you bring a Ducati and bring the tail back, what will happen? It's like Waterboy meets Elmer Fudd. Bleh, I don't know. Jeez. You just don't get it, do you? Bleh, what happens? He'll write off her debt. Ain't that right, Mr. Funny Duddy. What no, Mr. Funny Duddy. Please address me as swear to me. And your debt will not be completely cancelled. The 10 million Wuka you owe will be reduced to 9980,000 Wuka. Uh, how come we owe you so much money? We're just house cleaners at the Madam Mansion. You really don't get it, do ya? Mr. Fuddy Daddy duped us. I did not dupe you. You must pay for things you broke. Well, well, toil, says the proverb, is the sire of fame. Uh, what's that mean? It means you want to pay back the money? You gotta catch 500 Ducatis. <laughs> hey! Uh, that's easy. <laughs> My name is not Mr. Funny Daddy. My name should be. I will want you a twenty thousand Luca for each Ducati you bring me. That will wear it. It's like as I was doing it, I was like halfway between Waterboy and Elmer Fudd, and I was also just thinking weird shit. Ooh! It's like I I I just innately stopped talking. Humans are so annoying. I hate them. This is the closest place to the land of fairies. Be careful not to get lost. Well, I know. That's why I'm not gonna have encounters on, see? So, Skippy and Hamson are at least easy enough to grasp just by looking at them. 
And again, I'm not expecting high art from my voice acting here, but it's a chance for me to try something different, so... Are you lost? <laughs> you humans have no sense of direction! Hey. I'm new here, and I hate this level. This level sucks. There are a couple other worse ones, but see? I can go right past you zombos, and I don't have to fight you. Oh, these guys suck. They'll cling to your head and just eat your face. And then drain a lot of your HP. Not fun. So, yeah, bye. Bleh. Bleh. Where the fuck am I going? Uh. Bleh. Yeah, where was I going? Um. Uh. God, God. <laughs> See what I mean? Western jungle. Uh, nope. Mm. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh great, you give me three different directions. Now what? Uh, damn it. Uh. Uh -huh. Yeah, now you know why I turned them off. Fucking hell. Alright, let's go this way. Well, it's different. So there's that, at least. Hey, Zambo. Goodbye. That blockhead will never find this pathway! Also, I've heard it said that Skippy is a female. Never gotten confirmation on that. But I could see it. Man. Ugh. That fucking Sambo. Greenwood Gardens. Certain places are forced. No. And this one is one of them, it looks like. Yahoo! I hit! Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Hit one of them. Now, I suppose you get dizzy. There we go. Hooray! <gasps> Wait, no. Oh, hi there! I'll cast a spell on you so you won't get lost. Hooray! Well, I definitely needed that. So there are certain things you do have to do in this place to not get lost, and that is one of them. Ooh, spin. Okay. Short spin thing. Stop them from getting... To make them slightly dizzy. Uh, nah. Uh, was there a path here before? Who cares? 
I ain't gonna find nothing if I don't look. Duh. Duh. <laughs> Duh. Someone going over that way. I better get ready. Hmm? Oh. Duh. Hey, cheater! Ugh. Guess you didn't find nothing yet, huh? It's no Ducati, but there's some big animal back there. Hey, if we catch it, maybe it'll net, a, it'll net us some more dough. Duh, go be money. God, that ain't the right way. You really should listen more closely. I shall save, because getting lost in this place sucks. Ugh. Well, he is sleeping. Oh, my name is Rome. My sister Selkie went to find out why the fairies have been acting weird. She went to the courtyard of rain, but she might be hiding from Ducati now. Could you go look for her after you catch Ducati? And that is a Wisdom who is just flat out sleeping on his fucking throne. Acid? Okay. Must be in a bottle or something. Anyway, you gotta go down here. This is the Forest of Fairies. Humans are not allowed to enter. Words. Words I'm not saying. Bye. Uh, it's a whippy! Just one fit is one hundred thousand Luca! Get it for me and reward with money! Uh, oh no! Mm, there was a whippy! <laughs> you go away. me. Where are we now? Duh. I don't know. Uh-oh. Well, good. I don't have to worry about them. Poison powder? That sounds threatening. That is a Marlboro. I'd rather not. I'd rather not fight you. Uh, bye! Whatever. So this is where the fight happens. But technically, we still have to hunt the fucking thing. So what we have to do is get Skippy and Hamson to put aside their differences and cornered the thing in that spot, so I gotta go help their dumbasses. And no, I'm not thrilled about that plan. The game is up too sometimes. <laughs> Hampson ran into the fairy's land. Don't follow him or you go back. You should see the place I was just at. There's a funky animal down there. Man, this is going nowhere. Uh, dang it. Yeah. Uh. Hmm. 
No. So I gotta do something to get those two idiots to help me out here. talk to the Raziati guy again. So, yeah, now you know why I didn't have random encounters on. This would have taken like an hour. Or something dumb. This level sucks. Oh, there he is. Hello. Carty's been causing trouble around here lately. You might find him easier. Partner. Okay. That might be our flag. Yay! Yeah! Yay, yeah, we got a flag now! And I clipped the microphone. Damn it! Try not to do that. I forgot I'd been turning my microphone up higher lately. I've seen Ducati like a million times! Ain't no way I'm gonna catch him myself. Listen, why don't you and me team up? All right, let's try cornering. Let's go. Uh, I just can't find him. How about you and me work together? Uh, thanks. I'll rustle over and get him up. Wait! I ain't gonna lose it this time! <laughs> yeah, I have been turning the microphone on fire. Anyway, Ducati's territory. I guess it's another fucking. It's another fucking baboon boss, if you're wondering. Bye, dragon. Hey! Yep. Same dude. Different day. Cusplat. Man, 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 man. Ha ha! Now that I'm by myself, I better take this a little more seriously. Oops. Ow! That sucked! He's slow and dumb. Hit him a lot if there's no.
Well, it's going slowly, but it is working. Alright, great, kick me. Uh oh. Should have grabbed El Azul for this. But I'm definitely mauling him, if nothing else. Yeah, I'm just not doing shit for damage. But it's not like he's hitting me either. Sorry, this has been a very long, protracted fight. Yeah, even my major attack is not that helpful. So what I'm noticing about the flail is it's easy to knock them into a loop state, but... That's about it. But it's also to get easy to get stuck. Because I'm pressing... I'm just spamming circle, but... I mean, it is easy, but... Then again, this game is easy when you think about it. Ow! You kicked me! Ow! Runs at this guy, I should be able to take him out. God, there's so much fucking AP. Next time I'll bring El Azul along, it'll probably save me a lot of effort. Right in the butt. Yeah, that was a like five or ten minute fight that should have been two. Oh well. Yes, note, uh, note for next time. Don't just go solo. Duh. <laughs> You know, you and me sure don't get along. Uh, we're both wimps, too. We can't even work together when it matters most. Damn screensaver. Thank you for all your cooperation. <laughs> well, yeah, let, let's go. And I especially thank you for helping us out.
his 500 buka. Uh, uh, like anyway, Hampson and Skippy, you should follow her stunning example. I like people like you. Please take this. Hey, it's not nice. The sand rose. Alright then, let's head for home. Pawawa! Uh, okay. Uh, huh? We're moving up in the world. <laughs> Bye, sucker. I'm a sucker for doing this mission. I'm ready to go home. It took me half an hour. It took me half an hour to do absolutely nothing. But you had to go to the jungle to do one of the main storylines. So yes, that was mandatory. And I apologize for that horrible, stupid, stupid mess. But hopefully my stupid voices helped manage that. Cause you never know, see? You never know how stupid things will go. <laughs> Got lost? Sure did. Sure did, buddy. <laughs> Hunting to cut. Today, my master saw a really big tree-hanging monkey and a really big red animal with a really big attitude. Why can't they be more like me? Eh. You're a little cactus and they're a, small, they're a big giant monkey people. But that's enough big giant monkey people for one day. I'm going to call it an episode. Buh bye bye